Ever since Deep Seek's release, everyone has been so focused on it, but there's another Chinese AI that may potentially be better that has gone unnoticed. Today, I'm going to show you what Kimi is, what it can do, and how to use it. Kimi is a free to use open source large language model that has outperformed O1 in areas like mathematics, coding, and it can understand text and visual inputs like photos, videos, PDFs, and more, which makes it a multimodal, unlike DeepSeek R1. And just like DeepSeek R1, Kimi K1.5 Lawn Think is also a chain of thought reasoning model. Here is a picture of how well Kimi does against other AI. I wanted to see if Kimi can read the graph, and it can. Unlike DeepSeek, it can read pictures, videos, etc. So even if you are going to use DeepSeek as your main AI model, you can still use Kimi to analyze your photos and videos. Now I'm going to ask it for some good gaming mouses. Unlike ChatGPT and DeepSeek, it gives the Google search at the side, which could be useful, but it doesn't give any direct links. Medium are two sorted arrays. Let's see how well it does and whether or not I can answer correctly. So it took around seven minutes, which is a pretty long time, but DeepSeek also takes around seven minutes, while ChatGPT and most humans cannot solve that at all. I pasted it onto a leak code and it answered everything correctly. Here's a picture of some math problems. So Kimi will have to analyze the photo and also answer the multiple math problems. After double checking all the answers, Kimi has answered everything correctly. So here's how you can use it. Go to Kimi.ai and log in. You can use your American phone number, VOIP phone number, or any phone number, honestly. To use the 1.5 model, remember to switch it to LonThink, the newest model. This button allows it to use the internet, or if you turn it off, then it won't use the internet. This button allows you to enter common phrases, so you won't have to type them again, letting you save time. And this button lets you insert files.